Now that all the tractor work has been completed and all our rice fields have finally been planted, I want to show you the amazing little rice plants growth stages in this episode of Rice Farming TV. The variety of rice we planted this year was all cow rose medium grain. The first field was planted on the 6th of May and the last field was planted on the 26th of the same month. Now I've been across the entire county picking seeds and plants from several of our fields to give you, as I mentioned, a good look at the rice plant's growth stages. We've had pretty optimal growing conditions throughout May with temperatures in the high 80s, so we're going to get to see some dramatic growth in the rice plant's first 20 days after seeding. Let's head home into my office so we can lay these plants out and get better looks at them. And here we are, oh yeah, much better light. Okay, this is gonna be awesome guys. Just give me one second to get all set up. Boom, here we are and at one day, not much action. At two days we can already see some development as the coleoptal emerges. This protective sheath will eventually protect the soon to be young shoot tip or first leaf. Already now at four days we can see a more apparent coleoptal and the primary or first seeding leaf emerging from it. Its root is now about an eighth inch long. At one week, the second leaf has emerged from the sheath and is about a half inch long, while the root is nearly an inch long. At 10 days, the second leaf has grown to an inch long and unfurrowed. A root system is forming with the seminal root stretching an inch and a half long. At 13 days, the third leaf has emerged and grown an inch and a quarter long, while several roots are two inches long. At 19 days, the second and third leaf have grown dramatically. The plant is nearly six inches tall with a root system four inches long. At 21 days, the plant has tillered. Its first, second, third, and fourth leaf have fully unfurrowed. The plant is now seven inches tall with a root system of four and a half inches. Now, it's important to note that these rice plants' growth and their development, mainly in the leaves and roots, may not look the same depending on the farmer, region, and variety of seed. The most quantifiable difference in farming practices comes from a farmer's nutrient program, or how much fertilizer they add, which leads me to the most frequently asked question from last week's rhyming episode titled, How we plant rice, learning how to farm is nice. Tommy, Tim, and Glenn all pretty much asked, Matt, you applied fertilizer twice. What was the composition of the fertilizer in both instances? Well guys, the first application, if you remember, was with the aqua bar and the fertilizer was injected three inches deep into the soil. That was 100% nitrogen applied at a rate of 135 pounds per acre. Next was the fertilizer blend applied on the surface of the soil with the roller at a per acre rate of 32 pounds of nitrogen, 40 pounds of phosphorus, and 32 pounds of potassium. Now, another determining factor of the rice plant's leaf and root growth is from the farmer's irrigation practices. You see, the deeper the water, the more energy the plant will put towards growing its leaf. It wants to get out of the water to start photosynthesis. Remember back to my How Organic Rice is Grown in California episode? Organic farmers will put around 10 inches of water on their field after seeding to drown out the aquatic weed pressure. A side effect is stringing out the rice plant as it tries to get out of the water. So when we have two inches of water on a rice field during the first weeks of the plant's life, we only have a plant that's about four inches tall, but with a strong root system. An organic farmer or conventional farmer with poor water control can have the same age plant at 12 inches tall with just a little root system. And that has its own set of problems, but that's a topic for the comment section down below and a future episode of Rice Farming TV. For now, at least, we have a good idea of the early growth stages of our beautiful little rice plants. 
I hope you enjoyed this episode. It sure was fun for me to lay out all these plants and get a unique perspective of our fields. Give me a thumbs up if you had fun as well. Thanks for watching and peace out. <music>